What is up guys, welcome back to another League of Legends Wild Rift video and today we are actually going to be talking about some Wild Rift news with some uh, Team Liab Esports Kaigu uh, highlights in the background, they're League of Legends pro players so pl me, please make sure to check them out in the comments and description below. Anyway, so the Wild Rift news, right? Um, basically Riot Draggles, which is the leader of communications for Wild Rift, tweeted a bunch of stuff. First he tweeted that they are very glad with the feedback we are providing and especially the testers in Brazil and Philippines and that they are listening to all of it, they're reading through all of it, they are implementing a lot of stuff. They implemented more than just the balance changes that they did in the uh, during the alpha about a week ago. They implemented a lot more stuff but couldn't really put them into the alpha yet but they have them um, already. They're, they're changing a bunch of stuff, okay? But most notably, and I will show you this tweet uh, on the screen right now, the most important thing is that he shut down a rumor, okay? There was a lot of rumors that the alpha or the next closed beta would instantly start after this alpha is over. Uh, I saw that a lot in my comments, I saw that a lot on other social media, but he shut that completely down. He said that they won't be testing anytime soon again, like it will take some time. Um, it won't just instantly start again and basically he said that it definitely won't take as long as the since the reveal to the first alpha which was eight months right so it won't take eight months again for the next close beta but keep in mind guys and i think we can make a pretty fair assumption here again this is just my assumption but a lot of people's assumption actually because it's just logical um they can't just push out an alpha, uh, next close beta in the next two, three, four weeks, I think, because they don't, they only tested Android so far, guys, okay, in the Philippines and Brazil. They also want to test iOS. And with iOS, it's always a little bit finicky. You have to prepare properly, you have to communicate to Apple and stuff, the App Store, blah, 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 right? It's a little bit annoying uh, from what I've heard. That is why a lot of companies first test on Android. And yeah, basically they are gonna have to prepare that. They are gonna have to implement those changes. They promised another rioter, promised some control scheme changes um, and stuff like that, right? They have to implement those things. They might wanna add some more um, champions maybe, who knows, right? So they wanna uh, change some things. So we can't expect it really in a month, but I would say we can expect it in two to three months. Uh, probably a fair assumption because keep in mind guys they still want to push out this Wild Rift full release in 2020 okay so let's assume they will push it out in December of 2020 which is very convenient for them because that's the holiday phase that's where a lot of people uh, a lot of kids wish um, presents for Christmas uh, a lot of people are in the spending money mood right for these games so that's why you see uh, consoles and stuff like that trying to release at around those times. So that would be very, very good for them. And also, it is just the latest possible date you can do it if you wanna, uh, if you're still aiming for a 2020 release. And they are still aiming for that. They said that in a recent interview uh, by Feral Pony, as I said in my um, potential release date of a Wild Rift video already. So. Yeah, I feel like in two to three months, we can expect more like two, hopefully more two. Um, I would love to see uh, a closed beta in one, one and a half months. But honestly, guys, I think it's fine if they're just taking their time here. And yeah, that seems to be exactly the case. But keep in mind, we won't have a testing phase anytime soon. But they said they will push out a lot of info. They will keep these developer Q&As going. They will keep these developer updates going. So we will have plenty of videos to consume about Wild Rift. So I, I, I think they don't want to let this hype just die now and just they won't just go completely dark on social media for um, six, uh, for, for like two months now, I think. I think they will give us constant updates and yeah. That is pretty much it with this video. It was all about that potential uh, closed beta release date. I just wanted to make sure that everyone knows about it because a lot of these rumors are going around. I don't want you guys to be disappointed because uh, it won't. there won't be a closed beta in EU and A in like a week or something like some people assume. So yeah, I really hope you guys enjoyed this. If you did, 
leave a like, subscribe, and also make sure to follow uh, Kaigu and Liab Esports. Links are in the description and comments below. With that being said, I will see you guys next time. Peace out, boys. Bye-bye.